gonna press it for you. You got it. Where, where y'all taking me to jail at? Uh, be the uh, Roger D. Wilson detention facility. Where is that at? It's over off of uh, Washington Pike, East Town Mall exit. You got your phone on you? Nah, don't worry about it. If you ain't got it, don't worry about it. Excuse me, sir. Can you check my license? See if my license suspended. Yeah, it is. So he said, yeah, it is suspended. So now we did. Hey, can you take this man unloosen these coats, bro? These just I can't take them off, man. Hey, he's already put two on you, man, to man, make I'm it more comfortable. Though, Listen, we got we've got a policy. You see, I can get my two fingers in there. That's our policies. That's how we have to have them. They have to be finger gapped, man. This shit cut my circulation. I Listen, sir, here, I understand, but we've got policies man, we got to follow. Man, all right, man. Let me try one more to now. Come out right back to Matthews. Man, they got me cuffed too tight on me. I can't even talk on the phone. I can't even hold my phone to the river. Man, they got me cuffed too tight on me. I can't even Here, I gotta have that back, man. It's gotta go with your property. Watch your name. There you go, Sean. You don't have to do gyms for warrant yeah. arrest. No, not for a warrant arrest. You don't, have to have, you don't have to go to the commission. 182. 182. Dang. I wonder if my name is Edward. He made it from 
Hey Siri, call JJ. Calling JJ Keycap 4, Keycap 0. You got that, Brody? Yeah, I'm getting the last bit of it right now. Alright, look, check this out. Hold on, what's the name of the pit? Name of the jail I'm gonna be at, bro. The Roger D. Wilson Detention Facility. Man, we, hold on, I'm about to see the one I'm be at. Roger D. D. Wilson. And it's just detention facility. It'll be off of Maloneyville Road. Tell him he might want to wait just a few hours. A few hours. Well, because they've got to get you booked in. Like, once you get there, they've got to fingerprint you, they've got to take your photo, all that stuff, and get you booked in before you can bond out. Alright, bet. Hey, say, you can get my keys to Kingston. Yeah, we got you, man. Yeah, I'm gonna go get my keys to Kingston. Hey, Kingston, man. Which one y'all driving the car? You're gonna drive this car away? Okay, can I just see your license? I gotta make sure it's valid, man. That's just procedure. So are you guys going up there to bottom out as well? Or is that somebody else? Okay. Right, what are you guys going up there to bond him out or is that somebody else? Bottom out. Bond him out of jail? I don't know if that was you guys he was talking to on the phone or somebody else. Yeah, but he didn't say that. What are you, uh, where are they? Uh, you turn it down, I can't hear you. You good? He's right now. He's in the back of the car. No, it's just one. Your other buddy's good. He just he can't drive the car because his license yeah, is suspended too. That's awesome. That's yeah, awesome. yeah, he's good. He's right here. I'm just gonna check yours. Make sure you're valid, man. What's good? What's going on? You got John Jimmy car? One thirty one. Let's go. Yeah. You want to drive your car? Got a Florida DL when you're ready. Hotel six two zero five one three zero zero two eight eight zero. Fill your check status, please. So you're, are you you going up there, bond out? You got the uh -huh. okay. So yeah, give it a, give it a few hours. Uh, I'm not sure how busy they, the jail is right now because they've got to get him booked in before he can bond out. But if you go ahead and go up there, you know, maybe about an hour or two, and go ahead and have the cash in hand, then uh, they'll try to maybe speed the process up for him. But it's going to be a little bit. Uh, he's working on the arrest report right now. It shouldn't take him no time at all. He'll take him straight up there to the jail. He's not going right, to wait in a rat wagon or anything like that. So, so but, and just 
so you know, man, well, I'm sure you know yours is suspended too, uh -huh. so just make sure you're not driving, man. We don't want to have to, because we what we could have done with him if he didn't have the warrant was just give him a misdemeanor citation, which means he could have gone home tonight, and he would have just had to show up for court on a later date, pay the fines, things like that. But since he's got a warrant, fortunately for us, our hands are tied. We kept, there's nothing we can do with that. Go ahead. You got me negative NCIC to Monroe, Harris, Kingston, Class Echo, Class Echo, Valid. Temple. Sorry. Yes, sir. One in the I'll be 10 8, uh, detail complaint. If you can leave the call screen open, I'll be adding some notes. Heck yeah! <laughs> that dude was like a, what, I think he, the dude that had his, I had his Florida license, he's like 6'2", 280 pounds. That's a man. That guy standing on the side. Oh yeah, well, well, I mean, I was also down I here. Know, but it just, like, looks, it just looks so funny. Yeah. Old boy's tall. Alright, man, they're taking your car for you. So what?